and this is the, I guess we'd call the rear of the house. And I have to go up the mountainside. If you look at the dead center of your screen, uh, probably about a, a tenth of the way down from the top, there's a little horizontal line, and that's a, a rocky outcrop on the side of the mountain, just below the top. Um, and that's where I'm headed. Let me zoom in a bit. Whoopsie, it's a bit quick. There it is there. That's where I'm going. That's going to be the platform for the repeater. As you can hear, there's thunder, which does not make me happy. It makes me a little bit worried. Now, oh, plenty of storm there. It's pouring with rain all the way across there in the distance. Zip around here. The mountain carries on going up behind me. There's the beginning of the tripod. Standing ready. It'll be extended slightly higher and the equipment mounted on it. Let's get on that. The equipment box gets mounted on the tripod and this is done with some very DIY fabricated brackets here because this box is not designed to be pole mounted. Um, so fabricated these brackets, put bolts through, wing nuts to make it easy and that hangs on very nicely. And in here goes the 26 amp hour battery and in a moment the solar charging regulator, HSDPA modem etc. The beginnings of the solar panel bracket that's held on here with fairly conventional U-bolts and again wing nuts for easy quick assembly without tools. The next bit is the uh, what the arms that come off the side here that the panel mounts with. Those unfortunately uh, mount with M10 bolts for which I could not get wing nuts so I'll have to use a spanner for that one part. The solar bracket is now complete and we'll put on the solar panel. Getting a bit hair raising because it is actually now beginning to rain. Solar panel is now attached and the wind here is blowing pretty ferociously. I just hope that the downward force exerted by the, the weight of the solar panel, the equipment box and the big battery will be enough to keep this uh, stand planted on the ground because the solar panel acts as a nice uh, wing or a sail in the wind and the whole lot wants to go flying off. Almost done now. The uh, Ubiquiti 5 GHz link module, uh, HSDPA antenna. This does 900, 1800 megs and 2100 megs and uh, nice high gain. And of course the equipment box on the bottom on which we have solar regulator showing that the battery is all good fully charged and then inside here we have the <coughs> Netgear 3G router which is all fired up we have lights uh, haven't searched for the signal yet we'll get to that in a moment